I am back with another video. And as you can already tell by the title, I'm about to do a story time. Story time. About the time when I went to a Chris Brown concert. I'm going to have proof of everything. I'm trying to find pictures. My mom got, I got my mom's old phone like right in front of me. So I'm going to try to like put pictures of when we went like, you know, somewhere on the screen somewhere, you know. But like, yo, I got my tickets still. My mom got shirts made. It's, it's crazy. But um, just make sure you definitely like, subscribe, and comment on this video. Really crazy. But without further ado, let's just get into the video. All right, like I said, guys, so this video is about the time when I went to a Chris Brown concert. This was in 2011, so this was six years ago, guys. Oh, my gosh, like, Chris Brown. Like, I've been rocking, like, Chris Brown been my, like, favorite since 2000 and six five, no five five 2005 because my mom bought me chris brown's um album the chris brown album <sighs> oh my gosh so she basically she's the one who really put me on chris brown for real like so shout out to her like she's the one who really put me on chris brown bought me his cd still got that john still listen to this song you know but um so basically let's just get into the story we don't gotta talk about you know chris brown all that but so, 2011, I was like 10 years old at the time or whatever. So, my mom was like, so, how do you feel about, like, you want to go to the Chris, to a Chris Brown concert? He's kind of coming to, like, where I'm from or whatever. So, she, I was like, that shouldn't even be a question. Like, yeah, like, I'm with it. Like, and, um, but this, the concert happened a month couple months after my brother passed away so my brother passed away in august the um the concert wasn't in the concert was in um october like at the end so basically like i don't know but to my mom was, i was like mom that shouldn't even be like a question or like no type of like that's not even a question so she was like you want to like want, what you want your friends to like come with you or whatever i was like yeah but i'm trying to ask them to see like what's up so i go to school or whatever ask them like, it's, like, an event. Like, this is still, like, September or something like that. So, I'm, like, nobody trying to go or whatever. So, look, I'm going to just let's ask your cousin or whatever. That's when we, like, were, like, back then, that's when we, like, really, really were, like, close. Like, we used to do, do, like, a lot of stuff together. So, mom said, we'll just ask. We'll call her dad, and which is my uncle. She said, we'll call her dad, see if um it's cool if she come with us or whatever. So, that's when my mom said, let's see, did anybody else want to, like, go, like, so we called my other cousin and my aunt, which is my mom's sister and her daughter. So, basically, um, they was, like, gear yeah, or whatever. So, my mom bought everybody's ticket, and, you know, of course, they gave the money. Well, yeah, they just gave her the money back for what she paid or whatever. So I still got the ticket, so I like I found. That's why I said I'm gonna just do this story time. I found my ticket, so very good right here. Like this is not no fake stuff. Like this is real, like real life. It was upside down. I still got my tickets. Like so, I already gonna keep going. So my mom, we got the my mom got the tickets or whatever. So like all month, like I'm in school. Have I? I still have. Uh, I don't even have it on me. Like I used to have. I used to come. Used to go to school. With my um, with my CD player. I don't know if anybody remembers CD player. I probably put a picture of a CD player. I used to have a CD player with Chris Brown CD in her all like at all time. I used to have the Little Mama uh CD and Chris Brown. My dad bought me Little Mama and um my mom bought me Chris Brown. But anyway, let's not even get into all that. But I used to go to school. I had the little head like the little head says before beats and all was popping, and then I brought that to school. And I used to definitely be like I used to get on the bus, so I used to have that on before you know iPods, I and then um iPhones and all that. So I used to I listen to that all day every day, and then oh what's the um 
I ended up getting Chris Brown's other album, which is exclusive. I got that album. So I had that album. I didn't have the first one my mom bought me, but I had the exclusive album. So I had that. So my mom bought me exclusive, like, around that time or whatever. So I had that CD on. And I listened to both, but the exclusive was like, so I can know the song at the concert. I'm not going to be sitting there, like, mumbling the words. You feel me? I'm going to be up there knowing all the words, knowing all, like, the whole song or whatever. So, like, that month passed or whatever. So it's October now, finally. So it's getting close. So, like, about a week, a week, or, yeah, a week before the actual, like, you know, concert or whatever. My mom said, let's go get some shirt, some shirts. Maybe we can get Chris Brown on it or whatever. So, I was like, for sure, I'm down. So, this is the shirt, guys. Like, it's weak, but I don't. I'm about to see if I can look. I don't think I can fit this no more, but I'm about to try to squeeze through. But anyway, this is the shirt. We got it made. And we wore it there or whatever. And, um, so... So that like the day of the actual concert, we we put our shirts on, and then um, we said we might well go get something to eat. So we found some, so we found like we got we got there early like early so you because you know it'd be getting packed like at like concerts and so it'd be getting packed. So we got down there early, and we said we might as well go eat before we like so we don't gotta spend no money at the concert and all that. So. We go get, like, pizza or whatever. So, we're at this little pizza place. And it's, like, a two-level thing. And then, we like, we're on the second level. And, like, we're sitting by the window. We look up the window. We see Chris Brown's tour bus. We were, like, we were, me and my cousin were so, like, we were tweaking. I remember we was, like, so excited, like, when we seen Chris Brown's tour bus. Is he going to come out the tour bus? We was all, we were really just sitting there, like, we didn't even care about the food. We was, like, really look out the window. Looking at the tour bus, see if he's gonna come out. But anyway, so we ate our food and we're about to go into like the place where those concerts being held or whatever. And so we get in there, we find our seats, and we're just sitting there for the longest time. Like for the con, like it was taking forever. We got there, like I said, we got there early, so we were just like sitting there, like we waited for like a bit, like about 15 minutes to 20 minutes or whatever. So we're just sitting there. Then my iPod's about to die, so I'm like, this is not good. I was listening to Chris Brown's music before, like, while the concert was, like, about to speak, before it was about to start. So, basically, so we're waiting there, and then we see, like, the, the lights are starting to dim. And then we hear, I know T-Pain was there. I can't remember anybody else. I just remember T-Pain because he was the, like, the first, like, performer. It was, like, a couple other people, but I just remember, like, T-Pain, like I said. So... T Pain comes out and then they start performing. I don't remember what song they started performing, but I just know they start performing or whatever. And then we just start getting high. We start singing on the song. We start me and my mom, me and my cousin, we was um we was like, you know, singing along and all that. So then my mom, uh my aunt ended up calling my mom, like intermission, like like they performed everything. They performed like about good, you know, ten to fifteen songs. And that's when um, they had intermission. And then that's when my um, aunt called my mom and was like, where y'all at? And we was like, we're on this uh, this section at this, this, and this row, and that's this, that. So that's when my aunt called. was like, we got like three seats by us if y'all want to come up here. So we said, we might as well. It's closer than where we was at, and it was better view or whatever. So that's when um, we um, go down there, say hey to them. And then, like, intermission was, like, about to be over. And I remember Chris Brown started singing, Take it out. So he was, uh, he performed that. And then that, that day was just so lit, guys. Like, if he ever comes back, or I'll, I'll go travel. I just want to go to another Chris Brown concert. Cause if y'all like this story, too, I know I was, like, all over the place. And I was talking kind of fast, but, like. Cause I was excited. That's just I did that. That's my. That just might be like the best day like I ever had in life. Like, yeah, that just might be the like con. I don't know. That, and that was my first ever concert too. So like that was like the best day of my life. My first ever concert, and then like going to a Chris Brown concert at that. Like, that's that was the best day ever, basically.
that was just like the best day ever like if y'all like my story time or whatever just let me know in the comments down below and if you ever went to like a concert how did you feel about it or whatever like when your first time ever going to a concert how did you feel and who did you see like i want to know who like who did y'all see at your first concert and don't forget to make sure you like this video subscribe to my channel and you know leave some comments down below like i said and what you want to see in my next video I'm about to just end this video because it's getting already a little long. But um, that's basically my story time when I went to a Chris Brown concert. And I had fun. And I was excited. And I got to see his tour bus. Anyways, let's. I'm about to end right here. So, uh. Breezy! <laughs>